Okay, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest 4 by 4 Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Now let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. I just. Keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. <laughs> We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. <laughs> I got mud in my mouth. I'm getting nowhere ah. fast. We need traction here. Nathan, the rocks. I got it. I got it. Slip and slide. <laughs> the hang of this. There we go. <laughs> I got mud in my mouth. Spin out now. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. I'm gonna scout around. <sighs> Love this weather. Yeah, a bit humid. <laughs> Not Panama humid. Yeah, it's all relative, I guess. <laughs> hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the little guy? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 four four with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road. It might rain, it might be muddy. How about we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch?
There's a path at the mouth of that stream up there. Hang on tight. Take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on them. Sure. Maybe, uh, he helped them disappear. I mean... The guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. And go. And no. That was a valiant effort. Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. Pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sizzle. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. Well, maybe each captain was responsible for a tower, along with providing the men for it. Whatever the case, this certainly isn't our final stop on our tour.
Huh. Bark stripped away. Something was wrapped around this tree. 